In today's video, we take you on a hike of Lower Falls Brink in Yellowstone National Park. Today we decided to take a Jeep ride through Yellowstone and hit the Grand Canyon of Yellowstone, the, what's it called, Grand Canyon Junction, I believe it is. Mm -hmm. um, we weren't gonna do any kind of hiking. We did come prepared just in case and didn't bring the dogs. Uh, we just thought we would do the drive and be able to see everything, which you can, it's beautiful. Um, well, I managed to talk Randy into parking and going to check out Lower Falls. Brink. Brink is Brink. the key word there, exactly. Um, so that was what, three eighths of a mile? Mm -hmm. What was the incline? Was it 600 feet elevation? about 600 elevation? feet drop in elevation. And it's all switchbacks. Yeah, and it's so. tough, let me tell you. They say, is it, I think it's rated moderate, and it could be, I guess, um, but we definitely had to take some breaks. It's all paved, right? Yeah, it was, all it paved, was paved from what I path, remember, a pathway. It's narrow and it's steep. Very heavily traveled. The switchbacks, and there's a lot of people on it, so it's, a lot of times it's, you gotta stop to let people pass. Now, what we're, we're not sharing so much, I, I, from previous videos, you all know that I enjoy the waterfalls. So the whole purpose to this walk was to catch Lower Falls in the Grand Canyon of Yellowstone. I wanna see the actual water coming over the flow. From the bottom. From the bottom. Well, we didn't catch the word brink until yeah, after we, kinda, we got to the top, as you'll see. That one, yeah. <laughs> so Randy was like, oh, okay, well, this isn't quite what we expected. So as I said, we did leave the dogs uh, back at the coach because if we were going to do any hiking, they're not really allowed on the trails. There's no dogs and no bikes on this trail. Yeah, at all. So. What we wanted to share as well is that it was very heavily traveled. You want to plan to come in, as we've said in our other Yellowstone video, either do the park first thing in the morning before eight o'clock so you don't have any backup getting through the gate and your attractions that you're visiting aren't slammed with the people. Um, we went, I guess it was after 3.30 in the afternoon we went in yeah. and you know, over the <clears throat> summer you have until 9.30 before it starts to get dark. So that's a six hour window you can still use to tool around and visit the sites that you wanna see. Um, so we really recommend um, going in after 3.30. It's not too, too hot when we went. We didn't hit many backup at, at all, I don't recall. And let me tell you, you do want to do the Grand Canyon of Yellowstone. The water views are amazing. It is so beautiful. It's definitely worth the time to pop in there. Mm -hmm. We weren't going to, but we did. We added it last minute just to check it out. One thing you want to keep in mind, as we've said in previous videos, take your bear spray. Le I... Leprechaun spray too, you might need that. You'll see in the video. <laughs> yeah. We did see a leprechaun. We did, and didn't even know it. We didn't think they existed, <laughs> but they do. I saw one with my own eyes. Matter of fact, I stood right next to them. <laughs> <laughs> but you were too busy but I didn't, filming. I didn't find a pot of gold. <laughs> no, no pot that. of gold. We did get to see amazing views though. Yeah, the views were great. But um again it wasn't from the we wanted to be at the bottom of the falls so we went up the road and went into lookout point and then down to red rock point correct to get a mm -hmm. different view of the canyon and the falls from so i could get the view that a, i always dreamed angle, of which was amazing as well mm -hmm. worth it yeah but, so we'll save that for you for our next video so one thing i would like to say is make sure you take your trash you'll see in this video where people have leaned over the railing next to the falls and drop water bottles and this miscellaneous trash and it's pretty difficult to get at it yeah i'm uh, not sure who cleans that up i mean know, i guess the park I, service I the does park but service does or if it just ends up down in the canyon we don't want to ruin you know we're firm believers of 
Pack in and pack out. Pack in and pack out. It really isn't that big of a deal it to isn't. take your trash. If you bring it in, take it out. I mean, obviously, if you're walking up to a fall that has a 400 foot drop, maybe not have something in your hand that you could drop. Yeah. You know, so use a little common, common sense. sense as I know it's hard to come by these days. But. Mm -hmm. So again, we really enjoyed Yellowstone. There's four regions, um, the north, south, east and west. And you really should pop in to take a look at all of them. They're yeah, the geography little, is different, the, a little bit different. A little bit different in e each of those um, areas. So with that being said, here's some views of the Grand Canyon of Yellowstone. So the whole purpose to walking this was to see Lower Falls. Well, when we got, did you hear that? No. Okay. Jesus. Why would you stop it? Because. Because I thought something was walking in the woods. There. Oh. Okay. So <laughs> what, from previous videos, y'all. Wait a minute. All right. Cheese. Cheese, go. Okay. In today's video, we take you on a hike of Lower Brinks Falls. That's not right. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, give us a thumbs up, and we'll see you in our next video.